Good morning, CHS. These are your student announcements for Friday, March 1st, 2024. I'm Mikey Clover. And I'm Alec Fowler. The lunch menu for today is... Honey Sriracha Chicken Smackers with Roll Bacon Swiss Burger Waffle Fries Mixed Fruit and... A Chocolate Chip Cookie. Mm. <laughs> Happy birthday this weekend, Sue. Tara Moyer. Have a great day. Al, you know March is reading month? I didn't know that. I heard Alex made a clip on her book, though. Yep. Let's go check it out. You wanted to talk to me? You're divorcing me, but we have so many good memories. In The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo by Taylor Jenkins Reid, Evelyn hires Monique, a journalist, to write her biography and tells Monique her life story. The book goes from when Evelyn first decides to become an actress up until the day she dies. As Evelyn tells her story, it helps Monique see her own problems in her divorce from a different perspective and figure out what she wants to do about them. Out of the thousands of books I've read, this one is my favorite. I guess I understand. You have had a lot of divorces. I don't know if this would be any different. <laughs> Goodbye. The next Key Club meeting will be Wednesday, March 20th at 3 p.m. in room 402. If the weather permits, will we be going outside to do groundskeeping? There is a trout card sign-in sheet in the office for anyone planning to play spring sports. You will not be able to practice on Monday, March 11th without a trout card. To get a trout card, you must have a completed physical handbook form and emergency form completed on file in the office. Forms are available on the rack outside of the office. Please see Mrs. Nidro or Mr. Hemisberg with any questions. Attention National Honor Society members, our next NHS meeting is Tuesday, March 5th at 7.15 a.m. in the cafeteria. Attendance is mandatory. If you have sold all of your subway cards, you can bring the money to this meeting. Please see Ms. Pierce if you have any questions. Be a lifesaver. Donate blood for this year's Chestnut High School Spring Blood Drive on Tuesday, March 19th and Wednesday, March 20th during school hours in the auxiliary gym. Donors must be at least 16 years old, weigh at least 110 pounds, and have a valid picture ID. Sign-up forms are located at Mrs. Pierce's door, room 403, or see an NHS member for a recruitment form. Take a little bit of your time to give someone the gift of life. Make more money, have more job opportunities, and it also helps with mental health. During the month of March, teachers will be giving students slips for being caught reading at appropriate times. These slips can be exchanged for amazing prizes in the library, so have a good book with you at all times. There will be book talks and trailers on announcements, we will have book trivia for prizes every Tuesday, and at the end of the month, we will have a whole school silent read. So grab a book and start reading. Yo, Mike, did you hear that the Chesney Indians own the MMAC? I have heard exactly that. Let's go check out this clip. All right. Welcome back, CHS, to another sports segment for all your quality sports needs. I'm Slick Rick. I'm Charles Shamrock. Shake that. All right, Chuck, let's get back to sports. So far, we have four MMAC championships in football, soccer, competitive cheer, and basketball. Speaking of basketball, the boys went undefeated during the regular season, 22-0. Good luck with the playoffs. Congratulations to the swimmers at ISCs this previous weekend at Saginaw Valley State. Great job, swimmers. In addition, swim got fourth place as a team... And special recognition to Ariana Branzik and Sophie Grover for placing in the top eight for individual events. Good job, guys. Congrats to the bowling team for a successful season. And from the striker himself. Go bowling. Go bowling. Hey, Chuck, spring sports are coming up. Yeah, and we have high hopes of bringing home more MMAC titles. Come out to the district championship between OE and Chessoning. Goodbye, CHS. Catch you later. Goodbye, CHS. Have a great day.